Montaigne Center here in Beaumont, Texas, as Nichols comes away with a victory tonight, defeating Lamar by a final score of 74 to 63. We're joined courtside here by Colonel Head Coach J.P. Piper, and just a, a lot of good things to see out there on the floor tonight. Well, I, I love the first half. I wasn't as thrilled with the way we finished the game. I didn't think we matched uh, Lamar's intensity and their energy. And, you know, my thoughts are really on finishing the season with momentum and going into Katy, Texas with a chance to win games. And I thought the first half would get you excited about the possibility of that happening. And then the second half, we, we seemed to lose interest and just didn't defend with the energy and rebound with the energy that we had in the first half. And so... Um, that's a little bit of a concern. Um, we'll address it in practice. We talked about it just now in the locker room. Don't want to dampen the fact that, you know, you, you guys tell me we've clinched the tournament. So, you know, that's exciting. I did mention that to our guys that I thought we had clinched tonight. So um, a, a lot of positives. Hard for me not to focus on the things that I think will get you down the stretch, and that is that effort and energy in the second half. Um, you know, also good to win without Dan Trell with us tonight. So. Uh, a real positive there for our team. T.J. Carpenter rested the past week. He hadn't really been himself for a month now since that uh, shoulder injury suffered at Northwestern State. That that tonight was a T.J. that we saw in the early going of the season. Yeah, he really shot the ball well behind the arc, and he defended well and, and got some rebounds, and it was good to see him back uh, making those positive plays for us. And uh, I'm hopeful that uh, that rest uh, gets him to a point where – you know, what we did tonight doesn't set him back, and he's able to go again on Saturday. We'll have to see how his body responds, but, um, you know, it, it certainly makes a difference. And uh, it was exciting to see him knocking down those shots, and it makes the game a lot easier for us when he's knocking down perimeter shots, all those guys for that matter. I mean, we last few games we've been making two, one, uh, threes behind the arc. Tonight we hit nine of them. So, um, things really click, and it makes it easier for Fred and Jamarcus if we can knock down those perimeter shots, and, and that, that started with TJ tonight. Stan Brown finished with nine points. He only had two at the half, and that's really, you know, that's what teams focus on with Lamar. He's their only score in double figures this year, but Amos Wilson out of nowhere, 23 points, seven boards, four assists. He really did it all for them tonight. Yeah, he did, and, and he made shots that uh, the scouting report says he's not supposed to make, and he made them consistently all night long, so you tip your hat to him. Uh, I thought we contested some of those shots well. They went in anyway. I thought he played with a lot of energy. And I, I really like their freshman, uh, Ron Mitchell. Um, he played well tonight, too. They, they put him down on the block and posted him up, created a little bit of a mismatch for us uh, when Lyndon and Pedro were on him. Um, but, uh, yeah, you know, some, some, some guys stepped up to make plays for them that uh, we didn't anticipate necessarily coming into the game. But... Fortunately, we were able to get enough done where uh, it didn't hurt us. Capitalized on opportunities tonight. Turnovers, you're very efficient on the other end of the floor. Offensive rebounds, you're able to convert those into second chance points with great regularity. That's what you're going to need to do to beat teams if they're willing to give you something. You got to take it. Yeah, no question. Uh, I thought we were we were good at, at um, creating turnovers and then and converting them. Um, it's something we want to do. It's it's a little bit of a new identity for Nichols under me as the head coach, at least. Uh, so it was good to see us, you know, 24 points off those turnovers. 30 points in the paint's good. That means you're getting the ball to the rim. Um, so, you know, pleased, really, really pleased. I thought it was a good, well-rounded effort. I just, you know, like I said, a coach uh, in me being a little greedy wants uh, a little higher energy level in the second half. 